Hey guys, it's Kirk from I Am Music. Well, if you own a Worsi OAX instrument, you recognize the screenshot above. What do you do when you don't like the styles? If you're like most keyboard players, you're always in search for just the right style. So let's take a closer look at the Worsi Style Editor. That brings us to the next question, which is how do you get to the style editor? So there's actually two ways. Uh, let me show you the first one. So if you're in, uh, in your style section down here in the brown, if you click Mixer, you get this screen, which lets you do some editing, but that's not really what we're talking about. Notice up here it says Style Edit. So if we click this button, now you're into the real style editor. Now let's go back to the main screen and show you the second way is if you go to settings right up here and then on screen number one, notice we're at one of three, there's three screens under settings. So you want to be on screen number one. Notice there's style editor and let's click that guy and that takes you directly to it. So 50-50, which one you want to use, but this is the screen we want to start working with. Let's take a look at the physical buttons on your instrument, and you should all recognize the intro and ending buttons, of course, and break and stop and start, and the different variations. Now let's switch back to the uh, organ view or the style editor view, and notice up here you see variations uh, a, B, C, and D, break, intro, ending, fills, and lots of other stuff, right? So don't let this uh, screen scare you. It's not quite as bad as you think. But these sections or these buttons up here map to the physical buttons on your instrument. Okay, so far we haven't shown you a darn thing about how to edit a style, but we did show you how to find the style editor and what it looks like. In the next video, we will start getting into how to modify volumes and change instruments and some other interesting things. As always, thanks for watching. Grace.